Hi, this is from the AQA Mechanics 1B January 2013 exam. Um, in this question we're going to be looking at connected particles. We've got a tractor of mass um, 3,500 kilograms and it's been used to tow a trailer of mass 2,400 kilograms across a horizontal field. So I'm going to um, get going with my diagram straight away. So I'm going to draw my tractor here and that's got a mass of 3,000 500 kilograms and I've got a um, trailer here that's going to have a mass of 2400 kilograms and I'm not going to write in the units they're all standard units um, and the trailer is connected to the tractor by a horizontal tow bar which I'm going to draw in there as they move a constant resistance force of 800 newtons acts on the trailer um, so I've got 800 newtons that's going to be acting in that direction and a constant resistance force of R newtons acts on the tractor so I'm going to have R going to be acting that way I've also got a forward driving force of 2500 newtons which I'm going to stick on here that's going to be 2500 newtons um, and the trailer and the tractor accelerate at 0 0.2 meters per second per second so um, we've got motion this way of 0 0.2 meters per second per second okay um, the other thing that I need to make sure that I stick on here is that there is going to be another force and using Newton's third law we know that there's going to be a force that's going to be acting in a pulling direction um, on our trailer here um, which is going to cause a tension um, and we're going to have an equal and opposite force acting in the other direction on the tractors um, and we use the letter T for both of them because they're going to be the same as each other okay so to our question part A asks us to find R now R is the resistance to motion on the tractor so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a look at this whole thing um, together so we're going to have a look at this whole system um, as one body so um, we're going to use um, Newton's second law so force is equal to mass times acceleration and we're going to have a look at the net forces across this whole body here so um, we've got 2500 Newton acting in the positive direction we've got uh, our resistance to motion here acting in the against motion so it's direct is in the negative direction and also this 800 here that's against motion and that's going to be um, in the negative direction and our two tensions here um, will cancel each other out so we won't worry about those so I'm going to have my net force is going to be 2500 take away um, and I've got 800 here take away my unknown resistance here um, and that's going to be equal to mass times acceleration so my mass is going to be the total mass which is going to be 5900 times by acceleration which is 0 0.2 okay so if I rearrange this and tidy it up I should be able to now work out that um, I'll, I'll do it in stages so we've got 1700 take away r is equal to um, and that's going to be uh, 1180 um, and if I rearrange that r is going to be uh, 520 newtons Okay, so um, we've done part A, we've found what R is. Uh, part B requires us to find the magnitude of the force that the tow bar exerts on the trailer. Okay, I'm just going to move this over here. Just a bit more room. Okay, so there's our part A and um, Okay, so um, what we want to do is 
we want to treat this as two separate particles this time. So um, we have got just we've got uh, our okay. So we've got our tractor over here, and we've got our trailer over here. And we can now treat this as, as, as two separate bodies and, and their tensions are the things that are connecting them um, together. So because we're trying to find out what the forces on the table are, I'm going to use this here because there's less information for us to deal with here. So um, again, so on the um, on the trailer we're going to do Newton's second law which is force is equal to mass times acceleration so in the direction of motion I've got my T which is my tension um, and against um, that I've got my resistance so that there's going to be my net force and that's going to be equal to mass times acceleration which is 2400 in this case times by 0.2 Okay, so um, I can simplify that because I've got the that's going to be 480, um, which means the um, tension is going to be um, 1,280 newtons. Uh, there we go. Okay, so it says state the magnitude of the force that the tow bar exerts on the tractor. So, um, because um, of Newton's third law, we know that the um, the force acting this way is going to be the same as the force acting this way. So we are again going to get a value of one thousand two hundred and eighty newtons. Okay, um, thanks very much.